Hello everyone, this is Elise from Feta Printer. Today I'm so excited to share our showroom of our DTF printer with all of you. And now I would like to introduce the machine's detail, step by step. Let's begin with the DTF printer, FD70. This model is with double I3200A1 official Epson print head. And here is the Epson official print head label. And this is the capping station. When you turn off the machine, it will cover the print head to prevent the head from clogging. And here is the printing platform. Uh, the max printing width is 70 cm. And here are two media plates to make the film more flat and no wrinkle. So the PET film we recommend is 60 to 65 cm. On the left of the printer, this is the repair station. This part is like a mirror to reflect the situation of printhead. It is very convenient to maintain and repair the carriage. Okay, let's look at the back of the printer. We can see there are five colors ink tank. Black, cyan, magenta, yellow, and white. Every color ink tank volume is 1.5 liter. Please look at the white ink. When the machine is working, the white ink will stare and circle to ensure the ink supply continuously. And this is the teacup system. Now let's come to the right side. Here is the three-stage platform heating system. Front, middle, and back. The below is the platform printing suction system. Okay, that is all the details of our DTF printer part. Now, I would like to introduce our polar shaking machine. Here is the pre-heating system between these two machines. And this is the powder tank on the top. The powder will fall on the film when it goes through the tank. And at the bottom of the powder shaking machine, there are two powder recycling box to save space. This is a belt which can transfer the film to go to the heating system. And here is the suction system to ensure the film moves more uh, evenly. Okay, opening the heating part. There are four heating tubes on the top. And here are also an extra heating tubes inside of here for spare. This is the taking up system. You can see there is a button from here. That means the system can be manual or auto mode. And when you set up the auto mode, the taking up will work based on the printing speed. 
Okay, lastly, let's look, let's look at the bottom panel. The bottom panel can control the, uh, sh the powder shake, the belt move. Okay, these are the details of our DTF printer and powder shaking machine. Now next, let's look at how they work. Thanks a lot for your watching.